One of the common questions in archery is, do you shoot with one eye open or two eyes open? I've actually shot multiple ways and I've kind of shot in between as well. So for a long time I shot with only one eye open because I kind of struggled when shooting a scope as a target archer, I struggled getting a little bit of double vision. So I, I really started shooting with just one eye open. And I think for anyone who is, their eye dominant is opposite of the way they're shooting. So if you're a right-handed shooter, but your left eye dominant, theoretically, that's you're never going to be in very good shape because your left eye is going to be taking over and you'll just impact further and further and further left as for a right-handed shooter as the targets go back because your left eye is looking at that pin differently than the right. So closing that eye completely so that you're only using your, your subdominant eye that is the correct side for the way you're shooting, that would be critical. If that isn't in, in play here and you're right-handed and your right eye dominant, then even for me, being right eye dominant and right handed, I was still starting to get double images because I was shooting a lens in my scope. So what I started to do so that I could actually see better was I had a blinder that I had put on the, the brim of my hat so that I could in fact shoot with both eyes open but just my right eye was seeing that image through the scope. Now, one of the things that I've learned and one of the things that's critical, whether you're a bow hunter or if you're a target archer, is once you get into low light conditions, having your both eyes open or your left eye open as a right-handed shooter, it actually helps you gather more overall light and it doesn't seem as dark. And you're also able to like see what's developing, especially if there's an animal moving into position but having both eyes open allows you to gather more light. Now with that said, what I do now and what I would recommend you doing in the purpose of this video is I do squint my left eye so that I can really focus with my right eye during my alignment process. And what I mean by that is once I've anchored and I've put the tip of my nose on the string, which will then allow me to be looking perfectly through my peep sight. I'm then focusing on front sight. This is front sight, peep sight is your rear sight. I'm focusing on the alignment because I want a perfect eclipse all the way around this ring. I want a perfect eclipse. I don't want space underneath. I don't want to close off where I've got space over the top and I don't want space to the left and I don't want space to the right. So for me, once I'm looking through the peep and I'm kind of ready to start my shot, I'll squint my left eye down just so that I'm really focusing my attention through my sight picture. And what I'm doing is really checking in, which is a term I use. I check in on my rear sight and my front sight and how the, I have to adjust my head slightly so that I have a perfect eclipse. And once that's happened and I've moved my pin to the target and I've got my pin level or my bubble level, at that point I'll kind of let the left eye open back up to kind of see the whole picture and give you more light so that then you can pull all the way through the shot. So just to kind of give you a look here, and a lot of times this happens without me thinking about it, I've got both eyes open, I pull back, and right now I'll squint a little bit as I'm coming in, get my alignment. Pull through my shot, so let me do that one more time. Draw, anchor, Acquire peep, front sight, rear sight alignment. Check in. Pull through.
Anchor, peep, checking in, pulling through. There it is.